As soon as you sit down, still your mind and meditate. It's over. You no longer need to participate in your world of self-created problems, mental activities and imaginary suffering. Your mind is clear, your consciousness is raised and you're feeling more peace than you ever have in your entire life. Every single one of your problems slowly begins to dissolve because at this increased level of consciousness, problems are recognized to just be thoughts that are occurring within your awareness. Your once hectic mind begins to melt away and you are left to experience yourself as you are, pure empty awareness. Now this is just a glimpse of what you can experience if you learn to meditate properly. Now imagine experiencing this multiple times a day, every day, can you see? how this would completely reshape your mind, your reality, and your level of happiness. Doing this one hour of meditation consistently actually means that you are dedicating a portion of your day to true happiness. And if we know that all we really want in life is true happiness, what better way to spend your time? Sadly, most people will never wake up to the fact that the most important investment you can make is an investment into your own consciousness. Because the higher your consciousness, the greater your life will be. And with each meditation, you raise your consciousness. And so really, this is one of the most worthwhile things that you can possibly be doing. Every day, a choice is presented to you. Meditate or do something else. And the likelihood is you choose to do something else. And I know this because people are very lazy and they do not like surrendering their minds. And what I want you to notice is that whenever you choose this other activity instead of meditating, part of you genuinely believes that this other thing could somehow bring you more joy than giving yourself over fully to the present moment. Notice that whatever the other thing is, it has never done it for you and it never will. Because nothing outside of yourself can ever satisfy you fully or permanently. The reason why so many people are deeply dissatisfied in life is because in this situation, they always choose the other activity instead of meditating. And when you do this, what happens is your mind, it keeps running. And remember, your mind is the cause of all of your suffering. And so really, without realizing it, you're doing everything you can to maintain your suffering and prevent your happiness. In this way, most people never develop a deep spiritual connection to reality and thus feel hollow and then seek to fulfill themselves through external and material pleasures and comforts. Of course, this could never work. Happiness, on the other hand, is the full and total surrendering of yourself to the present moment. And each time you sit down and meditate, you empty the mind and return to this ever-present happiness. And when you get good at it, you can actually start to feel your consciousness being raised. And the feeling is, ah, why would I do anything else? This is all I'm after. And it was right here all along. The moment that this is made clear to you, that your mind is the sole cause of your suffering and that meditation gives you freedom from mind, you will intuitively move toward meditation and see it not as a chore, but as a gift. A gift from the universe to help you remember who and what you are. So if you meditate one hour per day, what ends up happening is a deep peace begins to pervade your entire existence. You feel lighter, things become clearer, the truths of situations begin to reveal themselves, and you as a human being become more emotionally mature and spiritually developed. In other words, deep personal and spiritual growth happens. So to sum up, if you want to be happier, Choose to sit down and meditate for one hour a day and you will see results. An hour is a very long time, so build up to it gradually. You can also break the hour up into numerous sessions. For example, I do 20 minutes three times a day. Just remember, if you do this and you do it every day, 
it will change things for you. And you will start to live a more fulfilling life than everyone around you. Because it is only once you begin to do the complete opposite of what culture and society recommends for you, do you actually find real peace, truth, and happiness. If you enjoyed this video and you would like more, please do subscribe.